the James Webb Space Telescope makes remarkable discoveries. It also collaborates with other telescopes to capture breathtaking images and will be described in this video. Decollage, liftoff from a tropical rainforest to the edge of time itself, James Webb begins a voyage back to the birth of the universe. The journey of the James Webb Space Telescope commenced on December 25, 2021, with the powerful roar of rockets propelling the Ariane 5 launch vehicle into the skies of French Guiana. Over two years since its launch, the James Webb Space Telescope has revolutionized our understanding of the universe. One of the many mesmerizing views captured by the James Webb Space Telescope is from the magnificent M74 Phantom Galaxy. In this video, we'll delve into the most surprising findings made by the James Webb Space Telescope, shedding light on cosmic mysteries that were previously unknown. Exoplanet possesses molecules supportive of life. In September, the James Webb Space Telescope made a significant discovery by detecting methane and carbon dioxide in the atmosphere of an exoplanet called K218b. This distant exoplanet orbits a cool star located 120 light years away from Earth and is larger than our planet but smaller than the giant planets in our solar system. Earlier observations from the infamous Hubble Space Telescope hinted that K218b could likely be a Hycian world, characterized by thick, hydrogen-rich atmospheres running with liquid water oceans beneath the surface. Recent James Webb Space Telescope observations support this hypothesis, revealing substantial amounts of methane and carbon dioxide, while indicating a scarcity of ammonia. Co-author and scientist Savas Constantinou, an astronomer at the University of Cambridge, has noted the following discoveries with the James Webb Space Telescope regarding the exoplanet. This means our current work is an early demonstration of the James Webb Space Telescope's capabilities in studying exoplanets within habitable zones. These findings stem from just two observations of K218b, with many more to come. Enormous distant galaxies unearthed. In February, a groundbreaking revelation emerged as scientists unveiled the presence of galaxies, comparable in mass to our Milky Way, scattered across images captured by the James Webb Space Telescope. They found galaxies in the telescope's pictures that are as big as our Milky Way. What's also interesting are the ages of these galaxies. They are believed to have existed only 500 million to 700 million years after the Big Bang, which is way earlier than expected. This discovery is making scientists scratch their heads as it goes against their current theories regarding the formation of these galaxies. The study co-author Joel Leisure from Penn State has also notes that these galaxies and their mature red stars inside them are causing a bit of a problem for science. The images from the James Webb Space Telescope show these galaxies as tiny red dots because of their distance from the Earth. By studying the light from these galaxies, scientists figured out they were looking at them during the very early days of the universe. This unexpected finding challenges our current ideas about how galaxies started forming, leaving scientists with a cosmic mystery that doesn't quite fit the usual story. Controversy surrounding universe's expansion rate. This year, the James Webb Space Telescope examined a group of stars called Cepheid variables, known for their immense size and reliability in measuring cosmic distances a crucial factor in understanding the universe's expansion rate. However, rather than settling the debate, the James Webb Space Telescope's data has intensified the ongoing disagreement over the Hubble constant. I'm not concerned about the specific value of the Hubble constant, remarked Adam Rees, an astronomer at Johns Hopkins University and a Nobel laureate. I want to uncover why our most reliable tools, our gold standard tools, are in disagreement with each other. The rate at which the universe is expanding remains a mystery, with a significant debate focusing on determining the accurate value of the Hubble constant, an essential parameter for estimating the expansion rate. Currently, model-based predictions for the Hubble constant clash with values derived from telescope observations. Black Hole Discoveries The James Webb Space Telescope not only uncovered astonishingly large ancient galaxies, but also made remarkable discoveries involving massive black holes. The first, Sears 1019, weighed in at 10 million times the mass of our Sun and was identified by the James Webb Space Telescope just 570 million years after the Big Bang, earning the title of the oldest black hole ever observed when it was discovered in April 2023. However, the James Webb Space Telescope didn't stop there. 
Recently, it revealed an even more ancient, massive black hole that existed a mere 440 million years after the universe's inception. The origin story of how these colossal cosmic voids expanded to such enormous sizes so early on remains a compelling mystery. Astrophysicists are currently exploring various possibilities, including the idea that these black holes form through the rapid collapse of immense gas clouds. However, other hypotheses suggest that some might have originated from hypothesized primordial black holes, potentially created moments after and in certain theories, even before the universe came into existence. James Webb Space Telescope's glimpse into early cosmic dust challenges. More recently, a studied young galaxy labeled JD's GS Z6 has become a focus of attention for the James Webb Space Telescope. During its observation, the powerful telescope detected unexpected traces of molecules offering insights into cosmic processes at a surprisingly early stage. Dust is a pervasive presence, from the familiar dust bunnies under our beds to the dark clouds obscuring our view of the Milky Way. In the realm of distant galaxies, it leaves its mark as signatures in spectra. Typically, dust contains carbon, a relatively late addition to the cosmos. Early stars had to forge this element from their initial reservoirs of hydrogen and helium. However, the James Webb Space Telescope has defied expectations by uncovering dust in a galaxy merely one billion years after the Big Bang. This cosmic dust exhibits a distinctive chemical signature suggesting a composition of graphite or diamond-like grains that originated in the earliest stars. This discovery not only challenges conventional wisdom, but also provides a fresh perspective on the processes of dust production and galaxy formation. Discovery of pairs of mysterious jumbios. James Webb Space Telescope, armed with its extraordinary observational capabilities, has uncovered enigmatic celestial objects that defy current understanding. Upon focusing its ultra-powerful eye on the Orion Nebula, the James Webb Space Telescope made a remarkable finding. 42 pairs of Jupiter-mass binary objects, aptly named Jumbios. These are Jupiter-sized planets drifting through space in pairs, with some separated by distances as vast as 390 times the space between Earth and the Sun. These jumbos, too small to be classified as stars, present a puzzling conundrum. Their existence in pairs challenges the notion that they might be rogue planets expelled from solar systems. This revelation has triggered an alert among astronomers, pointing to the emergence of an entirely new mechanism for the formation of planets, or even, intriguingly, for failed stars. Details of the Majestic Ring Nebula James Webb's Space Telescope has also provided an unparalleled view of the renowned Ring Nebula, M57, in Lyra, showcasing its intricate features in unprecedented detail. The Ring Nebula in Lyra stands as one of the most captivating planetary nebulae in the night sky, representing the final stage of sun-like stars. James Webb Space Telescope's observations have unveiled remarkable intricacies within the Ring, comprised of approximately 20,000 clumps of molecular hydrogen. What distinguishes M57 in James Webb Space Telescope's images is the revelation of 10 concentric arcs situated beyond the outer edge of the main ring. Astronomers speculate that these arcs initially formed in the vicinity of the dying star, emerging as ejected gas, interacted with a low-mass companion, orbiting at a distance comparable to that between the Sun and Pluto. Webb's Odyssey in the Orion Nebula at some point, we all have wondered where planets were born. James Webb Space Telescope has not only captured mesmerizing images of the Orion Nebula's captivating Orion bar, but has also delved into the cosmic cradles where planets take shape. In this celestial snapshot, the left image showcases a portion of the Orion bar, courtesy of Webb's powerful near-infrared camera instrument. Zooming in, the upper right reveals a smaller area under the watchful eye of Webb's mid-infrared instrument, MIRI focusing on a young star system named D203506 with its protoplanetary disk at the center. James Webb Space Telescope's observations go beyond just pretty pictures. They offer unprecedented details of these protoplanetary disks, providing tantalizing clues about the precursors to life. Take, for instance, the nearby star Fommelhout, where Webb discovered three nested belts of warm dust, hinting at the shaping influence of planets. In the case of PDS-70, water vapor was detected in the inner disk, suggesting potential access to water for any budding terrestrial planets. In the protoplanetary disk surrounding the young star, D203506, Webb made an extraordinary find, the methyl cation, a molecule likely playing a pivotal role in interstellar, organic chemistry and the genesis of life. 